Hmm. So I wonder what I am about to do tonight. Okay, so I'm on the floor. It doesn't look that bad. Ah, I'm giving birth. Yeah. <laughs> no, but really, this is a supine 90-90. See, my legs are up at a 90-degree angle. I'm supposed to be controlling my breathing while keeping my legs up and my feet flanged back for 30 seconds at a time. And this is uh, recommended by Amazon Halo Band. I had to do this twice tonight, and it was pretty dang difficult. Woosa, woosa. Let the rains come and let the gold rain, please. Okay, so this six point rocking it totally looks like, you know, Mayan worship or whatever, but yeah, your hands, your knees, and your feet are supposed to be pointed out. Well, planting you there on the ground. Uh, my feet in the back can't do so, and I forgot to re angle the camera for this. This is a bit easier, but the form is tougher overall. Okay, so for this last one, they call it the Sphinx, but this is pretty much just straight up laying down and breathing. <laughs> Yeah, so you're supposed to lay there. Um, your hands are supposed to be uh, pressed out a little bit on the ground, kind of like gripping it a bit. Uh, shoulders and elbows uh, are lined up. Uh, your butt is supposed to be just, it's supposed to be flesh. You're supposed to flex the muscles in it and then breathe in and out for 30 seconds. Aside from actually trying to be more fit and lose weight and be more active, I'm doing these things because um, I'm trying to increase my mobility score. Uh, I did a mobility test with the Amazon Halo Band about a week ago and I'm supposed to do a second one within a week. I'm going to record that one, I forgot to record the first one, but based upon the camera and the Halo Band itself monitoring me, they determined that I have very poor mobility overall from what you can see here and they suggested this exercise regimen to help out with it. Now it's not going to fix everything in two weeks, but it's supposed to help me improve things. So we'll see how that works. So next up, I did some squats and my kettlebell, it uses uh, straight up weights. I took them from my dumbbell, uh, ended up taking 17 and a half pounds. So two five pound weights, two two and a half pound weights, and two one and a quarter pound weights. So that's 30 pounds left on the dumbbell itself, but with that bar and everything on it, it comes up to 52 and a half pounds. So even though I'm only lifting 17 and a quarter pounds here with my squats, uh, it definitely adds, you know, more resistance, more, you know, challenge to what I'm doing here. And I'm looking at my face, I'm like, whoa, it did not feel like the way I'm looking while I was doing it, but apparently it was affecting me much more than I thought. So now I'm on the rowing machine. I also did some wall push-ups, but I forgot to hit the record button while I did them so they're not here on the video. This is just me watching a video talking about how Ursula is the, one of the best characters from Spider-Man 2 and, and doing parallels of comparing Mary Jane against Lois Lane from Superman 2. It made a lot of sense, so it was great to watch while working out. And hopefully I'll get the energy to silly mount my projector one day so I can finally use it again. Be nice. Okay, so that's it everyone. Thank you all for watching. God bless you. Bye-bye now.